The Warriors, 1979, 15 Things You Didn't Know About the Movie. The Warriors offers a unique glimpse into New York City's gang culture during the late 1970s and early 1980s. If you haven't seen The Warriors yet, you should watch it as soon as possible. It's hard to explain just how accurately and humorously they captured inner-city gang life in New York City during that time. The film stands out not only for its thrilling action and suspenseful plot, but also for its richly developed characters, vivid storytelling, and the way it encapsulates the spirit of a tumultuous era. Its cultural impact can still be felt today, influencing countless films, TV shows, and even music. Here are 15 things you might not know about the Warriors, Marts, Wall, and Ooh. 1. Real Gang Harassment The production faced significant challenges as the cast experienced constant harassment from real gang members during filming. In response, producers hired a security team and paid the Mongrels gang $500 daily to guard the equipment. Despite these precautions, frequent disruptions from onlookers and confrontations forced the crew to reshoot many scenes, creating a tense atmosphere around the project. 2. Improvised Taunt David Patrick Kelly, who portrayed the villainous character Luther, famously improvised his iconic taunt, Warriors, come out to play a... This moment was inspired by an intimidating neighbor from Kelly's own childhood, transforming it into one of the film's most memorable and quoted lines. The delivery has since become legendary, reflecting the creative freedom actors had on set. 3. Controversial Promotion The film's promotional campaign included provocative posters that sparked considerable outrage. Some groups called for the film's ban, claiming it glorified violence and gang culture. This controversy led to significant media attention, contributing to the film's notoriety even before it premiered. The discussions around its promotion and reception became an essential part of its legacy. 4. Accidental Injury During the production, Michael Beck, who played the lead character, accidentally broke a stuntman's ribs while filming an intense scene. He learned about the injury 37 years later at a reunion event, highlighting both the physical demands placed on the actors and the enduring nature of their experiences during production, where high-stakes action was the norm. 5. Presidential Fan One of the most surprising facts about the film's legacy is that President Ronald Reagan was a fan of the Warriors. He called Michael Beck after screening the film at Camp David to express his enjoyment. This unexpected acknowledgement from a sitting president not only elevated the film's status, but also graveyard. showcased its widespread appeal beyond typical cinema audiences. 6. Fear-Inducing Costumes During filming, people reportedly fled in fear when the actors portraying the Turnbull ACs dressed in intimidating gang costumes strolled into a nearby hamburger joint. Their ominous appearance highlighted how the film successfully captured the essence of gang culture, producing moments that felt both realistic and chilling, while drawing parallels to the fears many faced in urban spaces. 7. Screening Violence Although The Warriors was popular among fans, violence erupted at some screenings, leading Paramount to abruptly pull the movie from theaters shortly after its release. Despite this setback, the film still managed to garner significant attention and became a cult hit over time, grossing $22.4 million against a modest production budget of only $6, $7 million. This financial success contributed to its status as a classic, despite initial controversies. 8. Gang Cooperation To enhance the film's authenticity, producers negotiated with a real gang to appear in specific scenes. This arrangement included painting over their graffiti tags for those moments, showcasing how the film combined real-life elements and fiction to create a believable environment in which the characters operated. 
9. Threats from rival gangs. Adding to the complexity of filming was the reality that crew members received death threats from gangs that were not associated with the production. During one break, a rival gang even damaged thousands of dollars' worth of filming equipment, emphasizing the risks involved in capturing the essence of real gang culture for the movie. 10. Late-night filming. Despite the challenges posed by the surrounding environment, spectators often gathered to watch the filming, even at 3 a.m., in freezing temperatures. The buzz around the movie drew in crowds reflecting its growing significance in the community and the excitement it generated as a cultural phenomenon. 11. Real Gang Extras In a striking portrayal of realism, the conclave scene utilized actual NYC gang members as extras. To ensure safety, undercover cops were present in the crowd to help maintain peace and prevent any potential violence from breaking out showcasing the filmmaker's commitment to authenticity while navigating real-life tensions. Hmm, uh, yeah, 12. Wardrobe Precautions To keep the peace while ensuring the actor's safety, wardrobe teams took extra precautions by ensuring that none of the cast wore the warrior's colors offset. This measure was essential due to threats from an actual Coney Island gang who had a history in the area, further illustrating the very real dangers that surrounded the production. 13. Long shoot the filming of, of The Warriors required an extensive commitment, taking a total of 60 days to complete. The crew shot from midnight to 8 a.m. to capitalize on the gritty atmosphere and energy of New York City by night, which became crucial for establishing the film's tone and setting. 15. Real gang challenges, production security faced numerous challenges as they had to deal with real gang members who wanted to confront or challenge the cast. This high-stakes dynamic contributed to a charged atmosphere on set, enriching the authenticity of the portrayal while keeping everyone involved on high alert. Uh, stunt training. In pursuit of realism, stunt coordinator Craig R. Baxley put the cast through rigorous stunt training. Director Walter Hill aimed for the fight scenes to not only showcase choreographed action, but to feel raw and impactful, ensuring that the physicality of the actors matched the intensity of the story being told. In my opinion, The Warriors is one of the best corny movies out there. It balances seriousness and suspense, while many scenes turn out to be genuinely hilarious, even though the filmmakers were not really trying to be funny. The unintended comedic moments often arise from the absurdity of the situations and the larger-than-life characters, enhancing the film's charm and giving it a distinctive flavor that resonates with viewers. As we've explored, The Warriors is much more than just a film. It's a story of resilience amid chaos and creativity that arises from adversity. The challenges encountered during its production, from real-life gangs looming outside the set to the invaluable contributions from the cast and crew, have woven together to create a memorable piece of cinematic history. These 15 surprising insights not only highlight the complexities involved in bringing the story to life, but also demonstrate the film's lasting cultural significance and its impact on future generations of filmmakers. Ultimately, The Warriors has transcended its initial release to become an enduring piece of pop culture. Whether through its unforgettable lines, striking visual style, or the authenticity of its portrayal of gang life, the film continues to captivate audiences around the world. As we celebrate its legacy, it's clear that the Warriors will forever hold a special place in the hearts of fans, serving as a reminder of around? the challenges and triumphs faced both on and off the screen in the pursuit of storytelling that is as bold and fearless as the characters within it.